Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful viewers. How are you all doing today? I welcome you all to your channel. This is your host, Shivangsh. Those who are new to my channel, thank you so very much for tuning in. Virgo, this is your full moon energy check reading. That's how I have got the download to see what you can expect coming your way. All right. So I'm not trying to make these readings really long, but messages keeps coming and I keep speaking. All right. So Virgo, what I am feeling for you is that um you are coming in your energy of becoming the true man all right or true woman whoever you are watching this reading you are honing into your energy of an emperor or empress and for some of you i feel like that there are people around you who is trying to dictate your life and universe is asking you to come in your power and take charge of your life be that emperor or empress of your own life don't let anybody rule or dictate your life all right that's what i'm feeling queen of summers with nine of spring look i told you either somebody is manipulating your emotions trying to rule your life you are a very loving, comforting, emotional and intuitive person. All right. Your intuition is already telling you that something is not right. Somebody is, uh, you know, dictating your life or manipulating your life or, you know, using your emotions and abusing those emotions. All right. Because here the other card that is talking to me about nine of springs, that means something is there in your life that is burdensome. Right. You are tired of fighting. You're tired of uh, you know uh, going with the flow of you know as if like you are kind of somebody who is pleasing that's how i'm feeling you please all right protect the fruits of your labor all right that means you are so pleasing that you don't even learn to protect yourself okay prepare for possible challenges that lie ahead lie ahead you are experiencing some challenges and you are trying to find a way out to come out of it Emo, uh, environmental con conservation that means there are in in your environment all right it may be a boss also all right it may be a boss in the office who is trying to dictate you or rule your life or somebody in the family like a father figure or a mother figure telling you don't go do this don't do this and that is not making you happy and you are trying to find some kind of understanding uh, as to what to do and what not all right there are challenges around you and you are trying to find a way out all right i don't know if this is an energy of this t-shirt of like i'm wearing oops all right so it's like kind of a oops kind of an energy that's what i'm feeling and universe is asking you to be more vigilant and observant about whatever is going on around you all right that will bring a lot of understanding and clarity that's how i'm feeling you got to protect yourself all right stop fighting stop having any kind of arguments or uh, any and don't show any tantrums or attitude you need to calm yourself because you are truly a wonderful human being at heart all right with the queen of um, cups you are loving comforting emotional intuitive all right listen to your heart intuitive insights you can trust to whatever I am saying, your intuition is speaking to you loud and clear of what you should do, whether to pull back or talk or, or start, you know, continue with the fight, you know, taking care of others too much, perhaps. I told you, right? The first sentence here says, protect the fruits of your labor. As if like somebody is dictating your life and they are taking the credit for whatever you are doing. This is one possibility. It may be at the workplace, all right, or it may be your husband or wife or whoever, but has a very strong, significant role in your life, all right? You do too much. That's how you get manipulated. People use your emotions and then abuse you, all right? Take too much of you, but give you nothing in return. So you have to learn to create that boundary. What will happen if somebody keeps taking from you, taking from you, Virgo? You will be nine of wands kind of an energy. Dead and worn and tired. Wounded warrior, right? You are a wounded warrior then. Okay? You will never have any peaceful resolutions then to your solutions, all right? So learn to create your healthy boundary. Learn to say no where to say no. You know, learn to speak for yourself. Learn to come out. And I'm, I'm telling you, Virgo, your sign is a sign of dispute, all right? So if you are Virgo's ascendant or Virgo moon sign, then 
you will be surrounded by default that's your zodiac you will be default surrounded by disputed energies all right there will be dispute around all the time there will be conflicts and chaos around why god has put you in with that kind of a zodiac belt uh, and you experiencing this because you your soul with that energy has written a contract with the divine that whenever there will be something unethical or immoral activities are going on i will stand and i will speak that's why you get into disputes and arguments and this and that when you try to speak but ethics when it comes to ethics when it comes to dharma you have to do your karma you like it or you don't don't like it somebody likes it or don't like it they take it or they don't take it you have to stand for truth you have to come in your righteous energy of becoming that emperor or empress all right standing for your truth even if you feel like a wounded warrior you have to still take a stand all right don't let anybody play with your innocence or your kindness you have to be firm and determined and and go ahead and say hey this is right hey this is wrong don't do this all right i'm watching you don't think that how others are going to take it all right you will get into this environmental converse, uh, conservations where you will be like kind of yeah that's again dispute all right you talk about any topic you will see there will be arguments you are trying to say something there you will see there will be arguments the moment the argument comes you will pull back you will not talk no you have to finish the talk all right if your intuition is telling you your heart is calling out to you this is wrong and this is right universe is waiting on to see what action you are going to take are you going to run away if you run away universe will throw multiple different kind of towers some experiences until you learn to sit in your chair and take charge of your life all right so don't run don't don't uh, don't run away from your challenges face your fear come forward face it up front let me face it once and for all instead of running are you getting me talk it out speak it out voice it out all right because your intuition will tell you speak to you loud and clear you are missing a point this is a loophole you know you got to get into this conversation you like it or you don't like it somebody is going to appreciate it or not appreciate it all right otherwise your life will automatically be in that cyclical loop of any dispute arguments conflicts until you have learned to take charge of certain things that is going on around you all right because you are ruled by mercury my dear okay mercury is guru all right it gives you that knowledge to stand for something that you are seeing that there is a dispute somebody needs your help that's why you are born with that zodiac you have to take care of disputes going on around you standing for the truth standing for dharma speaking for dharma all right so you your zodiac sign itself is like that so if you are one of them them watching this reading not a cross watcher for something else all right then i'm telling you if you need any counseling please feel free to reach out to me ask your angels you have been asking questions and angel is also sending you the same information ask your angels you need answers to whatever is happening in your life and me coming and downloading these messages for you in front of you now and speaking to you about this itself is a sign whatever you are looking for all right itself is a sign what you are looking for so let me see what krishna has to advise you because i'm strongly feeling that krishna also needs to speak to you because of that purusha that is the way he's sitting in your sitting in the chair all right i am feeling that um, you know virgo you are going to experience some kind of a judgment call where you will be shown the real face of who you are and you will be forced by the divine to take an action by listening to your gut and intuition by asking your angels for support and help like kind of you are about to face something or you you are about to speak your truth like for example you are in love with a person all right this person also loves you but you have a fear to talk to your parents okay the angels will support you when you are ready to speak your truth and that's how you'll get your courage your guts all right and it will push you motivate you don't fear even if you are feeling like how do i speak like a wounded warrior fearful doubtful all right so don't do like that universe is asking you to just go by your gut listen to your heart follow your heart all right follow your intuition your insights are speaking to you your 
intuition is guiding you strong that you got to speak to this boss of yours or you got to speak to this team leader of yours or you got to speak to uh, xyz in the family of yours or you have to speak something that you have been holding on in your heart to your uh, divine masculine or your divine feminine however it is all right you are seeking for guidance mercy help support me coming with this reading is only to help you from this oops kind of energy i don't know why i'm seeing this oops today and this readings you know i'm going to change this t-shirt t-shirt now i'm not liking this oops kind of energy but yeah nevertheless you know hard messages are difficult to accept and take but this hard messages will pave a path for yourself all right everything that glitters is not gold okay so don't try to look for something that is glittering all the time look for those dark areas also you know and th that's when you know you can broom it out you can clean it out all right if you cannot see something under all right but you can send the broom and you can clean right so it's not necessary that you'll have to see okay all the everything and and do the cleaning but you know that when you are cleaning you have to clean this area also because the broom can go inside and you can clean all right so you have to do the cleaning part of your life right so that nobody takes you for granted nobody misuses your kindness your comforting energies your emotions or your loving nature all right because i'm seeing that you are a very loving and kind nature and people really misuse you at times all right tough times krishna is saying that tough times to whatever i have been speaking so far you are going through those tough times as i said let go of all that has happened so let go of whatever has happened stop feeling that wounded warrior all right the bad times will also surely go this too shall pass if you are feeling challenging at this point in time you will feel the challenge until and unless you face your challenge until and unless you face your fear until and unless you face what worries you all right as i told you if you don't face it god will send you even more tougher times tougher times tougher times until you completely come down on your knees so please 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 take action all right this too shall pass you don't have to fear believe in the in the divine complete destruction always leaves behind seeds of regrowth and regeneration so nothing really ends forever because energy cannot be destroyed it can only be transmuted transferred all right so once you have learned to take charge of your life the other person will see and from that moment on you will not experience any tough or challenging times all right things will fall in place sometimes you have to stand for yourself and speak for yourself you know be authentic about what you truly want and go for it all right that's what universe is saying tough times to this too shall pass this too shall pass just listen to your intuition okay ask your angels and the support will come achievements win the award accolade or contract some of you once you have taken care of this energy you have faced your fear you have learned to face the challenges worries whatever worries you you have learned to face it you will see some kind of rewards recognitions appreciations will fall in place for you all right so it is just a matter of time that you are fearing something and you are not taking action but by not taking action probably you see you are missing out on a reward may probably you are missing out on an achievement probably you are missing out on saving somebody's life you never know and start with yourself save yourself first if you want to save others and if you are in a big designated position in the office somewhere with this emperor card then come in your power and see everything as a human and try to navigate your life as a captain of the ship so that everybody else feels safe with you all right so i am getting this message in a multiple way for every scenarios that you may be associated with because this card plays a very significant role in your life this may be a father or mother figure this may be a boss or a team leader in the office to whom you whoever you report or this may be a man or a woman that you are in love with some kind of a hold this person has in you and it's time that you speak your truth rest your case 
and be in peace and that's when this achievement will come and follow you as if like you will feel like you are crowned so when you take charge of your emperor energy or empress energy sitting in your throne and know how to take charge of your crown take control of your crown because this crown itself is a responsibility that's when this energy will follow you this achievement kind of energy success feeling successful kind of energy no blockages no failure it's just a smooth flow just listen to your intuition and take charge of your life all right i hope this messages has helped you until we meet again i'm sending across much love and light to you all om namah shivaya stay blessed and in peace bye bye